I'm Dale Brisby, and we're here shooting an episode of Rodeo Time where we're learning the difference in a $1 horse and a million dollar horse. And I'm sure you know this horse, not to be the $1 horse. $1, 500, 1,000, 3,000. I got all those covered at my place. So I had to leave and come here to get the, uh, the fancier ponies. How much uh, time left collecting on him do you have? There is no, I mean, there's a there's a stud here that's 26 still collecting, breeding hundreds of mares. I'm gonna take as good of care of him as I can to help that go longer. But in the time that we have, I am collecting him for Frozen and kind of stocking that up as well because he does ship to Europe, Australia. And so I'm gonna try to have those banks even higher than they are right now so that in the case that he can't keep getting collected, you know, we're good. What's your long-term plan with him? To just do that as long as you can? Well, I have always wanted a stallion. I've always wanted to breed a stallion. I breed a very small group of mares, but I'd like to think they're pretty good mares. And I showed my entire life up until a couple years ago and kind of slowed down when I got married and had to, you know, get a job in house and things like that. And so I haven't showed as much as I did in the past, but I actually have a daughter of his and training for the futurities right now. So hoping next year to be showing some of his progeny and then I've got babies on the way by him babies on the way by other stallions as well it was kind of I think it was a god thing of god being like no you need a little Waylon baby coming because I had no clue that the sale was happening this year until July and then we bought him in August like it was a very like quick thing and so I have a really old mare that is very she's probably my best mare best producing mare and uh, we couldn't get her pregnant by the first stallion that we tried I said you know what I'm just bringing her to code red I know it'll work and I always love code red babies. And so it, it was by the grace that she didn't get pregnant by the first stallion that we actually had a code red baby coming next year. Um, but I have plenty of his daughters at home and I think I would love to have a young stallion coming up by him or out of a daughter of his and just kind of continue with that. I want to keep showing, but breeding is definitely my passion. What's it cost to breed to him? 5,000. And that's the first shipment is free. Um, that's with the shoot fee and everything and it's a live baby guarantee. Come on. Yep. Yeah, there you have it. Yeah, that's what and why <laughs> Code Red went for a million dollars. Yeah, and there, I mean, there was a stallion there at that sale that went for more. Really? It was a younger, it was a grandson of his named BS the Fireman. Um, so if you're looking for one that's in the $2.25 million range. Oh, heavens. Well, that's encouraging that he's, uh, that they're related. Yeah, so that's Sire, because he's a young stallion. So, B.S. the Fireman is out of a daughter of Code Red. No, don't do it. Don't do it. All right, here it is. Every time they roll, it's $1,000. <laughs> that's, that's the true test of their work. I'm so Every sorry. Times. I'm so sorry. <laughs> we got half a roll. Waylon. 500 bucks. A million dollar roll, what are you talking about? <laughs> Wayland. When you're on a property like this, those numbers are very, yeah. you know, with these kind of bloodlines. My oh, man's got a pet tortoise. What's up, Rosie? How old is she? Uh, she's about 88. Oh. That's an 88 year old animal. Good heavens. Sweet girl. I didn't think I'd ever enjoy petting a turtle like this. Hi. I'm gonna have to get one. Might have to build a turtle sanctuary now. This is Ike. I had Ike and Tina Turtle, but Tina turned into Tony. So I have Ike. This is Ike, and I had Ike and Tina Turtle, but Tina turned into Tony, so now I just have Ike. What do you mean it turned into Tony? Well, they, they sold it to me, yeah, they sold it to me as a girl, and it, it was clearly a boy after about two months. He's 500 pounds and 101 years old. He's about 480 and 19 years old. Oh, wow. Let's go carry Mike. <laughs> yeah, them jokers are strong. But they're like, they are like tanks. Nothing stops them either. They just go through whatever they want. He's perfect. Funny. Oh, there's a little piggy over there. I picked him up one time, but I ended up carrying him there. I didn't want my finger to get in there. Well, oh, wow. Mr. Rocky? Rocky's 101. 101. Hey, my daddy for the first time in 2019. Rocky. 
more than you turn. You're a hundred and one. You're over a hundred years old. You deserve bananas. Wait, you guys can go farther. Come on out. There we go. He was still having babies at 100 years old a few years ago. Is he going to have more babies? I don't have eggs this year, but the female lays eggs in December. Okay. So, yes, I hope so. So, he has his first babies in 2019. One more step in front of him, if you could. Yeah, perfect. There you go. For his confirmation shot before we go all the way out to the pond with Katie. While the sun's still high, I want to get his body shot in the sun. Good. I would bring the one closest to me, the front foot closest to me, forward another half hook. There we go. Thank you. And then his nose to me. Are we good with boys? We need some help on his mane. Oh my gosh. It's a wolf. <laughs> okay, here's my idea for this wind gust right now. Okay. Like, like a like, like beat the sides. My hair is kind of chopped. It's pretty vain and now it's about to go the other way. Yeah, it's just, if it goes the other way, my hair would be perfect. Let's go to the next shade spot over there and try to get some giraffes in the back of the shop. And then we'll find a windless area for you to get gorgeous shots of the hair and makeup outfit. I just need a headshot because I do love, like, I don't know if my curls are gone or not, but the curls. Yeah, they're still there. Okay. Just the wind blowing the face. Cool I, the back, I yeah. have the little, uh, <laughs> I do feel like it is hundreds. worth, when we find a flat spot there, I haven't got a full body shot. So I'm gonna back up, we'll stop right there, get a full body shot with the pond in the background, and then we'll get our giraffe shot. And then, sweet, we'll try to find, got it, safety. Yeah! Oh, I love! Well, we're just going to go with it. He loves it too. Okay, to the giraffes. Walk a circle, so that way when, oh no, Gerald, come back! Gerald! Gerald! Come back! Good. Bring that right hand around. Yes. Good. Beautiful. Y'all look gorgeous. Look down at him. Oh, God. <laughs> Cuddle session before he gets turned out. And, and the white shirt is done. Yeah, uh, yes. It's going to be done after that. Yep. <laughs> My hair just... Can I switch to this side? I feel like... We're done with me, thank goodness, because I was about to melt. But now we're gonna go turn Waylon out, let him run around, hopefully be majestic and maybe a little goofy and get some photos of just him. There, that's pretty, stop in the sun. Whoa! Oh. Whoa! Whoa! Oh. He's like, oh. nah. Oh. He did not listen to a single person. Not rolling. Not rolling. Perfect. Not today. Good boy. Whoa! Whoa. Oh. 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 He's like, you can't tell me nothing. Are we in one piece? That makes me nervous. I feel like I feel like it's a wrap. I feel like that's okay. You don't want one in the sunset with him? I mean, <laughs> I, th I think it's good. Okay. I don't know what my thing
look towards us. Okay, now carry on. Where are these women? Usually that's what people say to me, but okay, we're home. We're tired. I can't wait to go get back to my animals. She can't wait to get back to her animals. I should have probably said our, our men first, but it was such a fun trip. And I'm so like excited that everything went without a hitch. Like it was so mm -hmm. fun and stay tuned for the actual like photo reveal. That'll probably be on like Instagram or Facebook. Uh, so if you want to follow there, you can. And I'm just excited to show y'all what we got going next. So see you in the next video.